What's going on, y'all? That boy Gam back in the building, tapping in with y'all one more time. Um, just want to give a shout out to all my new subscribers and all my new viewers. I really appreciate all the love and support y'all been giving me. I'm very grateful, man. But if you're not subscribed, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Um, today, I just wanted to get on here, man, and give some information that I found. Um, I've been hearing a lot of talk about how the economy, the U.S. economy is not doing well. A lot of people are not making money. A lot of jobs, they're saying jobs are low paying. They're dead end. They're not really hiring. They say they hiring, but they're not actually hiring. And so one of the things that I wanted to focus on was you can either if you want to get out of this dead end rat race type of living, you either want to get a business, start a business or get a trade, a skilled trade. Now, what I would suggest is fix your credit because fixing the credit is going to help you as far as starting a business and the skilled trade because most trades you got to get a certification and you need to go through some type of class to get that certification. And as far as starting a business, you're going to need some startup capital. So you can get a business loan, personal loans, those type of things when you got good credit, right? But what I'm going to show you today is actually it was a list of things that you can do trades that you can get into without having a college degree, right? And I'm gonna tell you those trades and I'm gonna tell you what's the national average, how much do people doing these trades on average, how much do they make per year, right? So let's get into it. The first thing on my list, which a lot of people might not have thought about it's a custodian. Now, custodian, some people want to call it a janitor, whatever you like to call it, right? But custodians, they can make pretty decent money. Um, national average, they say custodians make about $35,000 a year. Not crazy money, but you know, it could be steady and it could be more. You see what I'm saying? Next on the list, it says a, a, a refuse collector, which I wasn't really familiar with this one, but it say a refuse collector travels throughout various towns and cities to collect garbage and recyclables. They will often follow a designated route to effectively retrieve items. Um, some refuse collectors have a lift attached to their truck that can pick up the trash and dump it. Other times, if the items are smaller or if the lift isn't available, the refuse collector will lift and dump the trash on their own. So I wasn't really sure, familiar with that one, but but it says that they make $42,000 a year national average. Third one was a legal assistant. Uh, Said legal assistants work alongside attorneys to file different case documents, assist with trial proceedings, and act as an assistant to the attorney. Now they say that a legal assistant national average salary is around fifty-one thousand dollars a year. Not bad, right? So uh, number four, bus driver. Everybody know what bus drivers do. You know, bus drivers um, in the, you know, local transport or school buses. Um, you probably need a CDL for that. But they say that the bus drivers on average make about $44,000 per year. Number five. Number five is a welder. Welders make pretty good money. Now, I say these numbers are national average, so it could be more. It could be a little less or it could be more. 
Um, national average for a welder, $57,000 per year. That's not bad. Number six, brick mason. Now, everybody know what brick masons do pretty much. You know, you, you work construction sites, building, land brick, you know, for the foundation or whatever. So, um, national average... $59,000 a year for a brick mason. Number seven, a construction equipment operator. So basically working in construction, but working um, the equipment, you know, machines, things like that. It's a construction equipment operators handle large machinery and equipment. Um, National average salary, $51,000 per year. Number eight, tractor trailer driver. So it says that a tractor trailer driver, national average salary for a tractor trailer driver is about $67,000 a year, which is not bad. You have crane operator. Crane operator, national average salary, $77,000 a year. It's pretty good. We got number 10, carpenter. Carpenter, national average salary, $54,000 a year. Now, number 11. A wind turbine technician. A wind turbine technicians say identify issues with wind turbines and will work to fix these problems. Uh, these positions involve climbing to high areas and repairing different sections of the wind turbine. And that job pays national average salary $68,000 per year. Number 12, HVAC technician. HVAC technicians will install, repair, and inspect heating and air conditioning systems. That job, national average salary, $70,000 per year. So it's pretty good, man. Number 13, licensed practical nurse. It uh, says licensed practical nurses work within the healthcare industry to provide proper care for patients. Um, many LPNs will work within the hospital or clinic settings to help patients and assist doctors. So it says the national average salary is $51,000 per year. Now, uh, number 14, diesel technician. Now, a diesel technician, they say national average salary is about $62,000 per year. It's not bad. Number 15, home inspector. Um, it says home inspectors visit homes to ensure codes and regulations are being followed. National average salary, $59,000 per year. Number 16 is a plumber. Now people, you know, people that heard about plumbers and heard about people doing plumbing jobs, plumbers, hey man, plumbers national average salary, $73,000 a year. You know, and that's the average, national average. So it can be more, it could be a hundred. Number 17, electrician. Another one that people have heard about, you know what an electrician does. National average salary, $53,000 a year. Number 18, boiler maker. Boiler makers will create boilers that hold oils and other gases and liquids. Once they build the boilers, they will often install them on their own. 
So Boilermaker, national average salary, $59,000 a year. Aircraft mechanic. Aircraft mechanic will repair any parts of an airplane to ensure it operates smoothly. National average salary, $60,000 a year. Number 20, landscape designer. So it says landscape designers handle and upkeep an overall design of outdoor spaces. They can build these designs for various businesses, houses, or schools. Landscape designers may draft their own exterior plans or are given plans to follow. National average salary, $63,000 a year. Now, last one on the list, number 21, construction manager. Construction managers will often serve in a leadership role as they oversee and direct construction employees in the completion of various construction projects. National average salary, $84,000 a year. Now, now, now you see that was 21 jobs and you know, they might not be jobs that everybody will want to do, but they say that these jobs are in demand, jobs in demand. Now, the thing is, once you get a skill or you get certified for any of those things, you will no longer have to look at these jobs, these dead end jobs that say they hiring and they not and all of that. So. I'm just trying to share a little information with the people because we all are trying to come up. We all are trying to be wealthy or just comfortable to support our families and all of that. So it's all about spreading the information and sharing it with each other, man. And YouTube is a great way to share information. You know, YouTube is also another option you know, if you want to start something, starting a YouTube is also another skill. You know, you can work on the YouTube channel, build it up, can be done, man. So I ain't going to hold y'all too long. Um, y'all go ahead and like the video. If y'all like this information or find it helpful, subscribe to the channel. Till next time, y'all gam tapping out.